welcome, <laughs> welcome. Thank you so much for joining us, 726 in Harrison, Arkansas. I'm Dan Reynolds, and over here is uh, the better part of the show, Ann Lindley. Hi, and thank you very much. That was very sweet. Did you like that? I wrote that. I practiced you did? that for at least half an hour. I thought it, oh, really? Yeah, different well, Can inflections. you do it again with a little more flair? I could. <laughs> but I won't. The, the moment is gone. <laughs> okay. How are you? I'm okay. How are you Summer's doing? coming to an end. Really oh, yeah, it You is. know, it's yeah. less than four weeks till school starts. That's mm -hmm. kind of where I know my summer is coming to an end. Yeah. But um, Will it be then it'll be football season. Withdrawal season, uh, withdrawal symptoms of any kind. I mean, you spent most most of the summer with your with your family. I have had a good time. And the come first September, we'll be moving. Good. Because we bought a. Did that, and that deal home. went through. That deal is good, good to go. Now you, you're living out in is, in Bergman, is that right? Toward it's Toward not quite area. to Bergman, okay. but yeah. Okay. It'll be out in that area right. with some acreage. It's always exciting to buy a new home. It is I exciting. I think people should do that once a year. I don't think you should move once a year because <laughs> I would have to probably pull my hair out. What little I've got. Yeah. That would yeah. not be good. But we're excited about that. And then, yeah. of course, my kids' school will be starting. Football mm -hmm. will be starting. It'll all mm -hmm. be all going crazy. Now, How about you? Junior high oh. football? One is in eighth grade, and my oldest will be in tenth grade. So wow. he'll have games. William will have games Mondays for junior varsity. Yeah. And then he'll have them Friday night for varsity. And then well, Robert will be Thursday nights. Well, enjoy it as, as someone that has raised two boys. Were they both in football? No, they didn't do any okay. football. They did baseball and okay. different things. But uh, that time goes so quick. I mean, they're growing so quickly right now. It and, is kind of crazy. And you need to you need to kind of grab a hold of the moments. Uh, I hear you. Because you forget. I mean, do you remember, uh, you know, when your kids were four and five years? I mean, it's kind of a long time ago. And, it is a long time ago. Yeah. And my oldest will be in high school this year, and it's, I mean, he'll be a sophomore, but mm -hmm. You know, they don't go to a different school until 10th grade, and yeah. it's kind of unbelievable. Well, enjoy that because they, the, the, when they, all of a sudden, they're gone. They're in college. And, and I see changes now even because, I, you know, I, I'm a cuddler. I would love to cuddle with them, and there's no cuddling going on at our house. Oh, yeah, I, I, would, nah. I would imagine. Done. Except for the grandchildren. Well, right? that's true, yeah. the grandchild, but yeah. that's a whole different story. But you know how yeah. it is. I do. The grandkids want to cuddle, and the big mm -hmm. kids don't. Yeah. So. Well, good. My summer's going fine. Your, I saw pictures again of your project. My little project, project yeah. It's where a, it's you had a to fabricate slow, a piece. You know, somebody said, you got to have patience. I, and someone that, as someone that was younger at one time in my life, had no patience whatsoever. We've never taken on a project like this. And it does take a, you, you have to get into a zen situation when you go into the room where all this stuff is because there's boxes of, is it kind of therapeutic for you, or is it? Yeah, uh, yeah, it is. Okay. Yeah, because okay. there's no one there, and no phones, no interaction whatsoever, this and it's just Dan me and the and the, the beast. monster. Yeah, <laughs> I'm having fun. Good, I'm it's glad. Good. I can't yeah. wait to, you know. I can't see wait more. either. I, you know, the the body work is something that I I had never dreamed that I would do. Uh, I did take a course when I was. 20 years old at Votech when mm -hmm. there was a Votech here in body work and you sat around all day beating on a on a fender I mean they don't even do body work like that anymore right. so I had had a little bit of experience in that area and it, it it is therapeutic and it is fun but but to to fabricate something that you can't just go out and buy that right. is, it's tough especially when there's there's contours and bends and things. But, It'll give you, know, you a whole new appreciation for your project, having put all your work into it. Yeah, and wow. you know, I bought this vehicle as a quick turnaround to put it back together and then sell it at a to make a profit on it. Right. I mean, to just be honest with you. But I, I put so much work into it that, I, that it's, I'm becoming connected to it, and I don't know if I want to sell it or not, right. at least for a while. Right. So we'll see. We'll see what happens. It's your buddy. I'll, I'll, it's my buddy. I'll keep you. I'll keep you uh, please, abreast of what's going. Please on. do. Oh yeah. Thank you. I, I enjoy hearing about it. <laughs> okay, should we go down the line? We should. I think. Right. I think it's a good. We got a fun show. F U N. We got a fun show today. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, no. I'm glad you spelled that out for yeah, our folks. F U N. This don't is know a how to F U N show. Do you? Yeah. F U N. Well, okay. capitals. That was capitals. It wasn't just you know just the small letters. These were the big F's. Okay. And the big U's and the big N's. Okay. 
All right. First up, we'll, we'll I can't even talk. Erin Finley is with us, and she is here representing New Fitness, mm -hmm. and they are going, she's going to talk about The Biggest Loser, which mm -hmm. I don't know what week we're in, but we'll talk to Erin more about that. We also have Daryl Horton, who is the director of the upcoming musical Peter Pan, which opens this weekend. Uh -huh. And we have some of the cast with, um, with us as well. I mean, just a very, very, very small portion it's of, a big, of, of it's the stage. It's a big stage. cast. And, you know, they had to, they had to stretch the stage out to, to make room for yeah. all of the uh, cast members. That's that, a they big had to, cast. They had to buy a stage stretcher to make that happen. It's a, you rent this thing, and it, it stretches the stage Are you out. serious? Sure I am. <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> and we're going to let them talk for a couple of segments, okay. it looks like. And then we also have Tracy Lindsay and Carl Gavin. They are here to talk about the halfway house for women in Omaha. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. and That's new. We have Anna Khan on the show if she is a... Oh, there yeah, she is. There she is. Well, looky I looky. didn't even see her, so... She snuck in. Actually, I saw she's her snuck in. To, she's here with Chiropractic <laughs> Health and the Fitness Center. Yeah, so we haven't we had her on for a while. So I don't know who's coming up first. We're just going to, like, roll with the changes. Let's roll. I think we're having her up front okay. since, since she's here. There she's she's, she's number one anyway. Hey, 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 I can't even talk. Okay. All right, we're going to go right. to break, and when we return, we'll have Anna Khan. Stay with us.